So no bus until 10 minutes later than I'd expect where than I'd expect there to be one. So I might be late. Hopefully I'm not. Hopefully everything else just connects really well and I'm not late today. <sighs> Great start to the day. <laughs> if I knew for sure that I could walk back up that hill, I would totally want to go walking down it. Just because I don't think I could. Especially not when I'm wearing rainbows. Hey guys, so I'm just at home and I'm watching the hockey game. Just got finished talking to my mom on the phone about some wedding stuff. And I just realized that we're going to have to send out the invitations about a month earlier than we had originally thought. We thought we could send them out in the end of February, but we have to send them out the end of January because of the hotels. Because if guests book the hotel at least two months before the wedding, they get a discounted rate. If not, we have to renegotiate with the hotel and some of our guests may have to end up paying more and we have to pay more and so we have to send them out so people book their hotel early, which kind of sucks, but that's what's happening. Just realize how fast it's going by, like it's going by so fast. So tonight, I think instead of, I was going to do some more like little cleaning here and there and going through some stuff, I think I'm going to focus on getting like paperwork and everything ready for the wedding and starting to get all of that together because time is going by. I'm still trying to get a hold of our priest to set up a second interview with him because I don't know. We just haven't been able to, so I've got to get that going. I'm watching the hockey game. It's currently 2-2. We're playing Boston. And uh, Bozak has scored twice. However, Bergeron and I don't know who scored the other goal. Um, so it's tied and it's only the first. <laughs> They're playing a very tough game tonight. So, um, But yeah, so I'm going to get on the wedding stuff. I would show you, but it's boring. So, there's that. Hey, so I just got off work. Well, not just now, but I'm home. I've survived the subway and the buses, as per usual. I've made a decision. I'm gonna go to the doctor on Friday, and I'm really gonna, I'm gonna see what all of my options are for my leg. Mainly because in the past she's just said, oh, well, you just need to have physiotherapy on it. But, and admittedly, I haven't been doing the exercises as of late, but when I was doing the exercises, I did them straight every day for like a good, gosh, I'm going to say like three months and nothing. There were small minor improvements, but there wasn't anything to the point where I was like, oh my God, I feel like a hundred percent. I was like, I feel marginally better. But then of course I would need to go to work and my leg would be like sore and I wouldn't wouldn't feel all that great, but I've seen, I've done a little bit of research and I've seen online that people have had like surgeries to remove like the bits, the extra bits of like cartilage that I have and things like that. So I'm just going to be like flat out whether I'm going to say like, hey, I, if surgery is an option, I'm willing to do surgery. Honestly, I'm sick of the camera doing this. Kadunk, kadunk, whenever I'm walking. Or just like walking in general because like, it's affecting like my back and my hips and everything else because everything is like connected, right? It's like, they say it's a system. So hopefully it's an option. Hopefully it's a good one. So after basically 12 hours of cooking, and then uh, a couple more hours of it just being on uh, on warm. We're left with two thingies of pulled pork, just like that. And it's delicious. I think it's honestly what I'm gonna do from now on. Basically, just let it cook overnight. That way, it is easy to prepare. Like this, it's good. All right, that's good. I like that. 
So one of the things, oh, there you go. So one of the things that I really hate about the whole streaming to the PS3 thing is that I, whoa, I have to crush things under my feet. What is that? Oh, why is that here? Why is the, why is this here? It's like right here. Okay. Yeah, I have to turn on the PS3 server thing. And it's annoying because sometimes, even though you've turned it on, the PS3 doesn't register that it's there. So I basically have to sit here and make sure that when it comes time for us to play a video, it's working. And, uh, and, so, and so there's that. It's annoying, and I don't like it. And the people who make the PlayStation server thing should do updates so that that doesn't happen. Oh, yeah. So there you go. And normally it should appear just underneath there. And it should say PlayStation server or whatever. So clearly it's not working. All right, so I'm going to go and re-thing the PS3 server. Speaking of PS3, guess what I downloaded today? Well, it's downloading now. Simpsons. No, better. Simpsons arcade game. Simpsons Christmas Boogie album? No. Definitely not. Some sort of Simpsons game? No. Better. Batman? No, but there's B in it. Assassin's Creed Batman edition? Doesn't exist. Some sort of Batman game? Because that's... That's worth downloading. No. I stand firm with Batman. Bioshock Infinite. Batman Edition? No such thing. Not yet. Right? There never will be. Don't say that. They're, they're not ready to hear that. So what was that? Bioshock Infinite. Batman edition? No, no some... there's no Batman edition. Yes! No. Yes! It would be a horrible game. Batman does not belong. I don't think we can in that continue this. World. Batman doesn't belong in the land of barbershop quartets. Ever. Are you kidding me? Batman would be the greatest singer. He could do all four parts at the same time. No. No, he could not. Are you saying that there's something Batman can't do? Other than bring back his parents? Sorry. Yes. Be an entire barber shop quartet. What does it mean? Alright. So, mm -hmm. good night. Cheryl is asleep. Because she's asleep. Um, see you tomorrow. There's... Yeah, that's really it. Bye-bye.